Previously on Max Keeble Update Year 5. No, I killed you! How are you alive, bear? No! You fuck! You scum of the fucking earth! No! Bear, why? I killed you! Hello. I'm Chris Peterson, businessman and entrepreneur. And look, I'm just going to get right into it. In 2020, the Rotten Tomatoes bear did not die from a tragic wrestling accident. I killed the bear. Or at least I thought I did. Because when Rotten Tomatoes sent me that cease and desist letter, and I thought it was time to move on, I thought it was over, and I called them up and they told me that they never heard of me, and they never sent me a cease and desist letter, I was stunned. I was confused. Until I looked out that window and I saw the Rotten Tomatoes bear looking at me alive. Because while I thought I was in the clear, he was out there scheming. He was out there plotting against me. Because he's the one who sent the cease and desist letter. He's the one who wanted me to move on. And look, now that he's back, I can't let that happen again. And Bear, all you've done these last five or six years is distract me, is to lead me off the path of finding Max Keeble a better review. You've been useless. You've not made me any progress. So look, I'm going to talk to you directly. Bear, do you know how much you've taken from me? Because over these past few years, I've had countless friends and family come up to me and say, Chris, what are you doing? Chris, you're wasting your life. And I had to tell them, until I was blue in the face, that I'm not. I'm not. Because nothing else matters. Only this matters. And look, Bear, come June 18th, I'm challenging you to a Loser Leaves Town match to end this once and for all. And look, I've walked all 10 and a half square miles of this town, and I've done everything there is to do, except beat you. So what I suggest you do is pack your bags, kiss your loved ones goodbye. Because come June 18th, loser leaves town. All right, welcome all, welcome folks. We got a backyard blowout match for you tonight between Chris Peterson and the Rotten Tomatoes Bear. And they're off. Oh, the lockup. Oh, they're trading blows. Now, the unique thing about this match is that loser leaves town. Yeah, you know, they've been fighting each other for a long time, and I'm finally happy to see a conclusion to this battle. Oh, oh the suplex. That's one suplex. Oh, a that's second. two. That's two. Here he goes, Jason. Oh. The three amigos, no! Oh, no, no, no! The bear, oh, Chris Peterson's in pain. He's in pain. He doesn't know what's going on. Well, it looks like he stole the advantage, though. Ooh, ooh, you never know with this bear. Folks, you want to tune into this match. This is the last time you'll ever see it, because they're never going to see each other again. When the loser leaves town, you know. Oh, he's blowing, he's... <laughs> He's blowing him. Oh, no. No, it's a hurricane runner. Wow. Chris Peterson's stunned. He never thought the bear had that much in him. Or out of him. You know, <laughs> he doesn't look like he has much, but this bear can really take a punch. Some say he's fucking tougher than a $2 steak. 
Ooh. Another punch. Oh my god. Giving him the rub. You know, oh, this, speaking of rub, this is the rubber match. The oh. end of Blood Feud. Oh. Got that him was, again. That was a good one. Oh. oh, man. Where are they going? Where are they going? I don't know. I don't like this. Oh. Not the shed. That's for recreational party use, not this. He can't even keep his little head up. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh. oh no, that's gotta hurt. That can't be legal in this state. Oh. Oh, see, you're seeing Loser Leafs Town is always a no DQ match, Jason. Anything oh, fucking God. goes. Not this. Anything but. Oh. Not the F, F number that I don't know. F69. Oh, what's this do? A face plant? I'd call that a big ouchie. <laughs> nice belly fucking suplex. Oh no, no, we should have known when you put this by the pool, something was going to happen. Sink or swim, this match has got to end one way or the other. Oh, oh dear. low blow. Dear, I always knew that bear fought dirty. He's going for the Spanish fly. Oh, dear God. Oh, no. Oh, a bit of an inverted fly there. God, I hope the lifeguards are on duty tonight. <laughs> oh, man. Wow, he is sinking like a dead man, or floating like a dead man. Yes. And after this match, Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's chest is on. Stick around. Oh, I love that Davy Jones. He is so spooky. Oh, man. Well, Chris Peterson's going up again. You know, when you're soaked in all that water and all these clothes, you know, it brings so much more weight to you. What is he? No. No. Oh, the Swanton Bomb. Dear God. That's got to be it. He's dead. He's dead. It looks like he's not done. I think Chris Peterson really wants to make sure this loser leaves town forever. Dear Lord. You know, that's what you do when you love a town. You got to make sure there's no losers in it. That's what you do when you love a movie like Max Cable's Big A Move. That's true. You give everything you got to fight. What is he gearing up for? Oh, God. Oh, he hit it. He hit it. That's no. Chris Peterson's Big Move. Oh, my God. Give him his hand held. Max would be proud. This one is done for. Now the hardest part of the match, swimming. Oh, it busted open. You know, the craziest thing, I just, you, you gotta wonder if Chris has enough to even drag his body out of the pool. Or even the bear's body. That's all. Holy shit, look at the strength on that boy. Yeah, Lord, he is busted open. Oh, he's going for the pin, too. All right, that's it. That's it's it. over, folks. The bear leaves down. The bear leaves down. Oh, my God. I told you. I told you I'd do it. This bear came back from the dead, thinking he was going to take me out, thinking he had to jump on me. But he didn't. I stopped him. It's over, man. It's over, loser leaves town. I never have to see this bear again. Look at him. He's busted open. He's, I wouldn't want to see his face again anyway. Let me try to patch you up, bud. You fucking piece of shit. For years, I've been feuding with that bear. And for years, it's been wasting my time. He's halted all progress. He's distracted me. But that ends today. Because now, with the bear out of my life, for good this time, we can move forward. Because next year, we're going to get back on track. We're going to get those signatures. We're going to go out. We're going to tell the world why Max Keeble's big move should not be looked down upon. You know, I was looked down upon by this whole Rotten Tomatoes Corporation that they sent a hitman bear after me for years. 
And look what happened, I prevailed. So Max will too. And I'll die trying doing that. So people watching, thank you. Thank you for sticking around all this time. Thank you for waiting to see this feud end. And please, let me be able to thank you for watching next year. We did it. We did it.